take a moment to talk to Johnny about some of your voice acting work. Obviously, everybody knows you as Adam, Black Power Ranger. And uh, just how did you get into that role as, as the uh, Power Ranger? How did that How did that happen? I went to an audition. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's really what it was, you know. Yeah. I, I was uh, I was in Texas and uh, I was at I was studying kung fu and I was at the school. And my instructor, um, Master Clark, uh, had seen like this ad in the paper and said they're looking for new rangers. And he's like, I think you should go and give it a shot. And uh, I went, <laughs> you know. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just kind of went through the audition process, which was horrible. But uh, yeah. Uh, was there now? You replaced the the original Black Power Walter, Ranger. Yeah. That was played by yeah, Walter. And uh, was there ever any animosity between you two? No, actually, I we don't have any issues with each other. And I see him, you know, occasionally at a convention or whatnot. Uh, but uh, yeah, there's, we don't have anything. Uh, there are some fans that don't like me because of it. Oh yeah. Yeah, there is one fan that I mean, for the longest time, this guy he has his blog or whatever. And he's just just ripped me apart on everything I'm in, game, voiceover, everything. No matter what it is that I do, even if I do a great job, it, he just just craps all over it. <laughs> and uh, it's, people would always send it to me, and I'm like, why do you guys send me this? I don't want to read this. Guy. Some <laughs> negative comments. And uh, then I find, I read this one thing, and, I, and he had ripped me apart on this film I did. And then the guy was like, dude, what did Johnny do? Rape your dog? And, uh, <laughs> and then uh, he replied to the guy's comment. He was like, no, he replaced my favorite ranger. Aww. I was like, wow. This guy's like totally hating on me because of that. Like, really? um, which is, it's just so stupid because yeah. Walter chose to leave, you know? And I was just auditioning for, uh, basically I was going to try to get a job, you know? And it's not like I was like, Walter, get out of here. It's my turn, you know? It's yeah. like, it wasn't like I kicked him off the show. Yeah. He left. Yeah. You know? And and he doesn't regret it. You know, that was the decision he made and I was, I'm glad I was in the show. I had fun. One other person that or uh, one of the other big uh, Power Rangers I noticed, uh, uh, Jason David Frank, he's starting to become into MMA and That's stuff right. like yeah, that. He's doing a lot of yeah, so have you, have you seen any of his fights or I've seen yeah, I've seen his fights. And uh, I always I always talk to him about it. He's, we're always texting. Yeah. He's, he's training half the time. Like when he texts me, he's like on the treadmill. He's like, no, 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 we gotta work out. Like, All right, cool. I'm gonna eat this burger. So, do you think you could take him? He's like 300 pounds right now. He's <laughs> pure meat. Uh, yeah. You stumbled into voice acting by accident, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You were you were doing a film. And I guess all the audio or something messed up, and you so you had to go back and do all of the, the audio work. And they said that you had a good hero's voice, right? And then from that, you got what is? I got an audition. Yeah. Basically, the producer was also doing other, like doing anime stuff. Right. And when he heard me, he told me you got to get a hero voice. Um, and uh, he asked me to come in and audition. Uh, and I went in, uh, and they showed me this anime. Now they first showed it to me, like it, sound, it was dubbed in English, and then they showed it to me in Japanese, and he said, can you do something like the Japanese? Um, and I was like, yeah, sure, I'll give it a shot. Um, I auditioned for it, and a couple weeks later, I got called in for a try gun. That was the first thing, yeah. And it was, I think it was a scratch track. It wasn't like the actual English dub. I don't think I replaced anybody. I think they had a scratch track or something. Yeah, and so it was like, what it was like to be like kind of part of that like phenomenon, or, you know, to see that industry just kind of explode here in America or that media I mean I mean it, it was cool at, I, at the time I didn't it was just a job I didn't think yeah. it was anything big you know I, I thought the show was good but I didn't think it was uh, you know the start of anything until I started going to conventions and then everyone was like this is my first anime you know um, so that part was cool you know I, I really just i Everything I've done has been a fluke. I've fallen into everything that I've been like. I mean, it's just been like, oh, I'll give it a shot, you know. Or I have a band, oh, I'll see. Um, so it's all, you know, it's all just been kind of sort of by accident or like, well, I've got nothing else. I need to do something, you know. And then 
I'm just so stubborn. I really work at something until I can, get, and I'm a bit of a perfectionist. So I think in some way I just kind of like really kind of push myself. You know, you're a martial artist, you're an actor, you're a voice actor. So, you know, what do you, we, how are you so talented? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's that, you know. I think I'm, I'm kind of like a, it's like I said, you know, if, it, if something interests you, you know, you'll, you'll pick it up, you know. Um, like I'm the type of person, if I want to know something or learn something, I'll just go learn it, you know, and then try and try to become good at it, you know, um, or at least until I get bored with it. Um, I don't know. I, I wouldn't say that I'm, I'm like, any more talented than anyone else. I'm just ambitious. All right. And uh, just there's a question for the band. Uh, were you guys fans of the Power Rangers at all when you were growing up? Uh, there was a big commotion at my church, and they're all saying, "There's Power Rangers. There's Power Ranger." So I, I was in middle school at the time. I went over and then I saw Johnny. I'm like, oh yeah, it is Power Ranger. <laughs> I was like, the first time I saw him, I, you know, I was like, this short, he was this tall, he had long hair. I was like, hi. It was, very, it was actually kind of intimidating. <laughs> then uh, I started following him around. <laughs> Just everywhere? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Still Pretty much. to yeah. this day. Yeah. I was a pretty big fan. Power Rangers used to run home and, you know, try to watch it after I got off class and got off school or whatever, and uh, I had, like, a, like the cards, and I had this uh, lunch bag, it was like a plastic one, and in high school I had this friend, she's like, oh, she saw it, and she's like, oh, I know, I know one of the Power Rangers, and I was like, yeah? I was like, get him to sign it, she's like, all right, he goes to my church, and I was like, okay, cool, so she brought it back and it was Johnny's. <laughs> signature. <laughs> and then, an interesting story. That's crazy, right? Well, I didn't know Johnny and then anybody, you know, because I grew up growing up in Japan. So first time I saw him, you know, he asked me, "Do you like Japanese anime?" Blah blah blah. In the elevator, yeah. then I said, "I love Akira." Then suddenly he shouted, "Like <laughs> that's <Tetsuo! laughs> Are you kind of like he showed me, like, "I'm awesome." Like. <laughs> <laughs> that's not the way this, <laughs> not how that worked out. That's, that's his version. That's, that's the way he remembers. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>